as you guys exalt here um shrine of secrets this week we are currently looking at four perks as usual we have got blood warden at the top available from freddy krueger aka the nightmare i've got a two out of five rating because of its inconsistency in use during end game it's obviously fantastic when it works but it's so hard to make work that just drop down the rating a little bit when it works great bit of fun and can turn a game around from being like a 0k to being a 4k potentially it's very hard to pull off next perk on the right here we've got dark devotion available from the plague Dark devotion is a fun perk that i personally enjoy quite a bit on hag and in stealth builds for different killers i've given a 2.5 rating i think that's a little bit too high after reconsideration but i'm going to leave it my original score i gave it Difficult at times to really make use of it because you, you need to find the obsession consistently for the game and then keep ignoring them and find other people. But it's fun to use, especially with stealth builds, like I say. Next up at the bottom, we've got Deliverance gained from Adam Francis as, as survivors. Um, Deliverance allows you to unhook yourself as long as you have safely unhooked somebody previously in the game. It also requires you not to be unhooked before you try and make use of the perk, otherwise it won't be useful at all. Decisive Strike and Break will pair very nicely with it. Um, but yeah, it's got a 2 out of 5 range just because it's difficult to use and you can't always guarantee you're going to be the first person to unhook somebody before you get hooked. Next up, we have got Windows Opportunity. It's got a 1.5 out of 5 rating. It's gained from Kate Denson and it's got that low rating because it's more of a new person um, perk. Useful to know where pallets and windows are especially if you're a newer or it's a brand new map just help you out a bit there but once you get used to maps and you get a bit more experience in the game it becomes less useful compared to other perks that you could probably put on your builds um overall that gives us a total of 8 out of 20 and that is this week's shrine enjoy guys and i'll see you in the next one Bye bye